All right, hi everybody. We're working through the Math 31 Limits Review. This is question 1S. And again, it's another limit as x approaches infinity. So what we're going to do with this right here is we're going to, uh, just like we did before, we're going to multiply numerator and denominator by 1 over the largest power of x in the denominator. Okay, in the denominator, because I want to get rid of the, the infinity in the denominator in particular here. So now this is going to equal the limit as x approaches infinity of, now this 1 over x is going to distribute to both of those radicals. Okay, and my next step is going to be to get that inside the radical. Now to do that, okay, to get something inside a square root, I need to square it. So what's going to happen here is I'm going to square the 1 over x squared, and what that'll do, okay, is this, I'll end up multiplying by 1 over x squared by each of these terms. So this will end up being 3 over, well, I don't know why I did that, sorry. It'll be, end up being 3 over 1, which is just 3. This term right here will end up being um, 1 over x. Now, because it distributes to both terms, I'm going to include it with both terms here. So the 1 over x becomes 1 over x squared. This is going to end up becoming x plus 2, sorry, 1 plus 2 over x. And our denominator is just going to become 1. So now all of a sudden, because we've done this, the denominator is no longer an issue. Now, if I let x go to infinity, this term goes to 0, this term goes to 0, and so I'm left with root 3 minus the square root of 1, but the square root of 1 is just 1, so this ends up being just root 3 minus 1. And there's our infinite limit.